Hey guys, welcome to Excel Automation channel. Uh, this is Mudit Lalwani and uh, today I'll be explaining a small code you know, uh, yeah, which can be used in big software also or in your daily Excel working also in which what I will be explaining is if you know if we are sup uh, if suppose we are selecting any name from a drop down list suppose jodhpur or ajmer or jaipur something it we what we want that by default uh, rajasthan come in any other specific cell now one option is either you can write if formula in your excel working but there are chances that anyone can delete that formula or something so this is mainly used in the forms which uh, uh, which we are sharing to customer and we want to you know customer to fill some data and if he is writing jaipur there then automatically by default rajasthan should come in a specific cell so i'll be telling you vba code for that and uh, we'll be doing uh, i've used that thing in my uh, invoice software and uh, i'm using in general um, my excel files also so let's see let's go so as you can see that uh, this is my invoice software which I made. This is the logo which we have clicked and this lock screen came. This is all Excel software and um, we have created this whole software out of Excel only. So I am not explaining full software uh, here, I will be explaining just code. So directly we will be going to final invoice and uh, uh, let's select number limited. If you double click here and it will search that invoice will come. We have option to select so, um, this software is made for a company which have you know four or five subsidiaries company. So they have different different logos and different different names. So they told me um, uh, to select the name of their choice. So if they will select A, then you can see that the first company will come, which is Excel Automation Limited. And if they select B, then invoice will be raised with the name Excel by Mudit Limited. If they will select C, then company name should be uh, will be changed to Mudit Lalwani Limited. The logo will also come different different uh, it is not showing here but it will show in invoice I'll tell you so currently I'm selecting this option A and okay let's do manual change in that so here you can see that logo came and Excel automation came and what I want to do in this invoice is if I'm selecting any bank here like uh, SCB bank HDFC bank or any UA bank then automatically suppose uh, in this column UA should come or any specific data should come like that so that code for that uh, let me explain you in new excel This is just sample data which I'm just creating right now. What I want that suppose if uh, Raj is selecting any city from drop down list here, and uh, for that, what we'll be doing going to this data data validation 
we want a list which should come and the source is this one okay okay so now if raj is selecting jaipur here then by default state should come as rajasthan now city can be lucknow also delhi also Let's make it more complicated. Yeah. So what we want only if you will select Jodhpur, Jaipur, uh, Udaipur, and Ajmer, then only Rajasthan should come. Otherwise, it should be zero or blank. Okay. So for that we will be writing a code. Now one option is as I told you in the initial part that you can write if formula here, but then there is a chances that uh, it can be deleted or it can be changed. But we don't want that. We just want a code which should be inserted. Then what we will do? First of all, as you can see that this is a new Excel. You need to save this file as macro. Macro enable work. I'm uh, saving in this desktop, and uh, and instead of Excel workbook, it is very very important step. You don't have to save an Excel workbook. You have to save an Excel macro enable workbook. Then only your codes will be work. And here you can see there is a developer option. But in case if you do not see that option in your computer, then what you have to go do? You go to you have to go to file. You have to select this option, and go to this customize even, and then click on this developer option, and then click on OK. Uh, by doing this, you will be able to see developer here. It is very important. So the next step is we have to go to developer tab, click on this Visual Basic. Now. You can see many things here, but uh, in your desktop you won't be able to see because uh, uh, you will be seeing only one uh, uh, this project uh, with your uh, Excel file name. So our Excel file name is cell change one. So you have to go to only cell change one. Now you have to go to sheet in which you want to implement that code. So our sheet name is sheet one. So I'm just double pressing this sheet. Now, instead of general, you have to select worksheet here, and by default, a, a selection change will come. Now, what th uh, this means is that whenever you will be changing anything in your Excel sheet, then that code will run. You don't have to additionally do anything. So, whenever whenever you will be selecting that Jaipur here, automatically when we'll go to next step. That means that selection change has happened, and automatically that code will run, and Rajasthan should come here. Okay, now we will write our code here. So, just the name of the code I am writing: cell change, Mudit. And now our code will start from here. So, what we want to do is if Range now, what is our range name? Our range name is G3. Okay, dot value. So if our range G3 value is equal to Jaipur, then then what should happen? Then again, just copy it. 
and paste it then the value of g4 should change to rajasthan okay now let's see if our code is running so as you can see that i'm deleting this rajasthan again so if i'm selecting any other city like chandigarh the state will not come but if i'll suppose if i'm selecting jodhpur also the state will not come only if i'll select jaipur and then click on any other button rajasthan will come so our code is running properly now what we have to do we have to give more condition like it's not jaipur we want it even jodhpur udaipur ajmer if uh, is user is selecting then the state rajasthan should come so for that what we'll do we'll just copy this we'll write or jodhpur again we will paste here we'll write udaipur you have to write or here in between now let's see so i'm deleting this so so if i'm selecting chandigarh it will not come if i'm selecting chennai it should not come now if i'm selecting udaipur it should come as rajasthan so like this uh, according to your file need you can change the uh, codes also uh, with this logic and if you have any confusion on this codes or similar files like this you can just text me on uh, my comment section or you can write me on linkedin also so hope uh this code will help you in automating your files for similar videos like this um subscribe to my channel you can see my previous videos also uh, i hope those will be useful to you and uh, till next video goodbye